close your eyes and watch your breath all the way in and all the way out. As for what other people are doing, that's their business. You've got to take care of your business inside. Because as the Buddha said, this is where suffering comes from, comes from inside, and the solution lies inside. Our desire to know things outside pulls us away from our real business, which is to take care of the fact that we've got a lot of greed, aversion, and delusion running around inside here. We've got to take care of it, otherwise they're like it's like keeping tigers in your house. If the cage is strong, okay, they stay inside, but sometimes the, the bars of the cage seem to be weak and the tigers go out and they not only make a mess of your house, but they go outside and make a mess of the neighbors. So take care of business inside. Watch your own mind, get to know your own mind. And when it's about to go for greed or aversion or delusion, try to catch it in time. Now the problem is we like to go along with these things. We like running after them. So we have to give it the mind something better. That's why we meditate and get the mind still. Get the mind still so it has a place to realize, okay, the stillness of the mind is where real happiness lies. And all that other running around with the tigers and lions may be fun for a while, but it, it, there's no real happiness there. And a lot of damage can be done. So. Try to keep the walls of the cage strong, the bars of the cage strong. You do this by being mindful and being alert. Those are the two qualities we develop as we focus here on the breath. If you're not alert, okay, the mind will wander off. If you're not mindful, you forget why you're here. So keep coming back to the breath, Remind yourself, this is where you have to stay, right here, right here, and be alert to what the mind is doing so it doesn't play tricks on itself. And that way, after a while, the, the bars of the cage will be strong. And you can start to starve the greed and aversion and illusion, because you've got something better inside. You've got the nourishment of the meditation, the nourishment of the concentration. So look after business inside, because that's where you're responsible. We look at the world around us and we see all kinds of horrible things happening. Well, there are a few things that we can change, a few things we can help with, but a lot of things we can't. In the meantime, if we're focused too much on the outside, we neglect the inside, which is where your real problem is and the problem that you are responsible for. That's where that lies. So keep your awareness here inside. Not that you're not aware of outside, but you have to realize that this is where your primary focus has to be, what's coming up inside the mind right now. So you'll be in a position to do something about it. That's what's called being responsible.